Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, today, in addition to uh, some of my other things that I'm doing for St. Patrick's Day, uh, I'm going to have some carrots because, well, I'm having corned beef, potatoes, and, well, cabbage just, I don't really like it. So, I picked something orange, like, you know, one third of the Irish flag, and, uh, yeah, so anyway, carrots, carrots, carrots. Um, these are regular ass carrots, and you're going to cook them at 105, 185 degrees for one hour, a lot like our potatoes that we're doing in our other video. And uh, basically these are super duper simple. Uh, first thing you want to do with carrots is wash them well. Uh, they're pretty sure they just rip them right out of the ground and throw them up there. Uh, after that, chop off the tops, okay? After you chop off the tops, and we're not really going to do anything with any of these here, uh, you know, stalks or whatever. Uh, we're going to peel them. We don't want the skin on them. Uh, it's not very appetizing. So I'm going to show you what that looks like here in a second. Once we're all done with this, then we're going to season them. Uh, we're going to use uh, in the bag mixture. We're going to have some extra virgin olive oil, honey, salt black pepper, and some ground cumin, because I heard that is good on carrots. So, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and peel these, and I'll show you the next step. Okay, here we are with our carrots that are nicely chopped and peeled. I arranged them head to toe, uh, just so they'll fit in the bag a little bit better. But uh, without further ado, let's season them with a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, You only really have to do one side here, it's not a big deal. Uh, just a shake of ground cumin. Don't want to overpower it. Alright, so actually, in addition to my paprika, I'm going to add some, or sorry, in addition to the cumin, I'm going to add some paprika and some cayenne pepper. I'm going to make these nice and spicy because I like my carrots spicy. Same thing as last time, you know, uh, roll the cuff of the bag out. And then we're going to uh, do the same thing as we did with the potatoes, which is just take the uh, nice flexible cutting board and get those in there. Now it might get screwed up a little bit, but don't worry. The vacuum sealing will pretty much take care of all that. Our carrots in the bag. So now it's time to add our uh, olive oil and our honey. So we're just going to add a little squirt. Maybe a teaspoon, tablespoon of honey. You can be generous with it. It's not going to hurt anything. Whoa. Except if you get it on the outside of the bag like I just did. A little bit of olive oil. Squirt that on in there so it makes a nice seal when we uh, vacuum seal this. There we go. These you can actually spread out a little bit. Um, you know, so the surface area of the carrots is completely uh, touching the water. Our water's ready to go. Our carrots are ready to go. Our potatoes are ready to go. Our corned beef's getting ready as well. Let's vacuum seal this up. Try not to suck too much carrot juice through your uh, vacuum sealer. And make sure they're nice and tight as well. That's good. That's what you want right there. So we're going to plop this into our 185 degree bath. That once again, I've been cooking at 185, actually 187 degrees for approximately an hour, maybe a couple minutes more. But you take these out, they're really hot, um, but you can feel they're springy. They're, uh, they're done, but like I said, they kind of have a spring to them. They're not mushy at all. They actually, uh, they feel just right. So, all you have to do here is throw these bad boys on your plate. Alright, so I normally don't do close-ups of food, but I just want to show you how uh, perfect these carrots are. Oops. <laughs> here we go. You can cut right through them with a fork. Not even trying hard at all. They're perfect. Absolutely perfect. Cooked all the way through, 100%, and they're delicious.